Bromsgrove Rovers are also through to the FA Cup third round for the first time in their history. Their home tie with First Division Barnsley isn't exactly a dream draw, but it's whipped up some real passion down in Worcestershire, as Andy Knowles reports. Bromsgrove Rovers have been regular headline makers this season. Their cup triumphs at Northampton and Yeovil have made for good news copy. But as this week's local paper rolled off the presses, those headlines were taking on greater significance, highlighting the biggest day in the club's history. For the past three years, Theresa Phillips has reported on Rovers' rise from Beza Homes League football to Vauxhall Conference runners-up and FA Cup third-round debutants. She has no doubt about the secret to Rovers' success. Team spirit. I ask, this, I, I, I ask Bobby Hope every time they have a major success, what's the secret, Bobby? And he says, team spirit. They're a wonderful bunch of lads who get on really well on the coach, in the dressing rooms and in the club afterwards. About the other side, is yeah, it the same it's price just all round? The same price yeah, okay, I'll have two, please. Yep, that's fine. That's fourteen pound, then, please. All of Bromsgrove, it seems, is up for the cup. It's the club's first ever all-ticket game with a capacity of just under five thousand, and that in itself has created headaches for the club's commercial department. For unlike the players and the manager, they're full-time employees currently working overtime to stage the game. We're a small non-league club trying to cope with all the extra work and all the extra interest that's generated. We weren't prepared um, to host a game of this scale. Um, we've had to put on extra refreshment facilities, um, signage, um, barriers. Uh, a lot of work's had to go into the safety element. Rovers Itis has also blitzed the club shop. Over £2,000 worth of shirts, scarves and hats have been sold since Christmas. The people of Bromsgrove are proud to wear the team's colours. We thank them for putting Bromsgrove on the map. The uh, club is in excess of 100 years old and I would suggest this is probably its finest hour. Confidence is high, so too is the expectation. Will you be able to relax and enjoy the game? No. I don't think so. I'll be there pretty early, half past 12, I should think, and soak up the atmosphere. I'll, I will be nervous for them. I'd love them to do it. It'd be brilliant. Well, there was very nearly another surprise just down the road from Kidderminster. Bromsgrove Rovers came within minutes of emulating their success, but it wasn't to be. Barnsley made a dramatic comeback. Bromsgrove went ahead on merit in the 31st minute through Mark Crisp, a splendidly taken effort from a Rob Shivlock pass. But two goals in the last two minutes put Barnsley through this Owen Archdeacon's winner.